Yeah. Just give me give me a sec, let me get to my computer. I need you to check us in as Delta Week for the last two hours. Something really weird just happened. Alright. I got it open. Um uh I mean I see some activity, but REM maybe. Theta seems a little abnormal, but within range. Check the gamma. In the feed too. Check the feed. Hold on a second, Gamma. Gamma's on fire. Was she was asleep? This visual feed was from yesterday. Perfect seems to be batch processing. It might just be some sort of loop. No, 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 no. She text messaged her father from her iPad in her sleep. You're, you're telling me that Perfect is bypassing operating systems of unrelated devices. No, not really. I mean, we piggybacked the Perfect processors off the Syrian LP, so anything is possible. Dr. Holly, if you expect me to help you, I need you to tell me how this thing really works. You don't want to tell me, it's fine. But we're dealing with a way bigger issue here. To send a text means perfect has drifted outside of Ascenda's visual cortex and taken over her executive function. Yeah, well, she was sleeping. It's probably just neural spikes propagating. Study protocol says we're to remove the device. She's your daughter. Baby. Baby. Listen, I need you to wake up, okay? Can you sit up for me? Do you remember that thing we talked about a long time ago? Big Cam? Big Cam. Okay, it's really important. I need you to do it for me, okay? <sighs> Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer, do. I'm kind of crazy, crazy in love with you. She's fine. It's just a frequency issue. I'm that's a date problem. I'm gonna talk to him in the morning. Alright. Listen, baby, I'm so sorry I woke you up, okay? Here, go back to sleep. Thank you for doing that for me though, okay? Yeah. Sorry, baby. Hey, you don't know me, but I got some questions about Perfect. I mean, you see we got increased activity in the beta and gamma frequency bands. See these oscillatory patterns? It looks like what we see in memory. I mean, it's abnormal in REM, but these... Huh. Yeah, I see. Dr. Holly said it was a frequency issue with the chip. Could that be... <laughs> really? Look. Okay. Ascenda sent a text message off her iPad to Peter. 
And he's in Australia while she was sleeping. Could that... Yeah, Dave. Our baby's finally learning. What, you didn't think I wasn't gonna track you here? What did my little brother tell you? Nothing. Can you play the story about how you used to cut the wings off butterflies? No, you didn't. Yeah, I was jealous they could fly and I couldn't. Listen, I'll tell you what you need to know, but you're gonna have to do something for me first, all right? We started this work a long time ago. We were creating a neural prosthesis to cure Parkinson's. Our mother had it. I was starting to show symptoms. We could never really nail that down, could we, Dave? Yeah. There have been really huge advancements in neural prosthesis for the blind. The visual cortex was all mapped out, contained. It was our door to the brain. All we needed was the right deep learning algorithms and data. And we could fix anything. No one with fucking finances, though. I ended up taking this like research position over at a bioengineering startup in Melbourne. Dave thought I gave up. Didn't you, Dave? Never give up. That's right. You never give up. Two weeks later, I sent him 18 terabytes of data. I scammed my way into this uh, transcranial magnetic stimulation study run by the US military. Man, gold mine. Thousands of MRIs, EEGs, psychological profiles. Took a year to run it. <sighs> yep. All we needed was a young plastic brain that was born totally blind to run it on. Wait, before Ascenda? No one wants to experiment on children. Peter, Ascenda's father, was the head researcher at the company. He helped me. He wanted me to survive. He's a genius, really. I don't know how he looks at me anymore. His wife, his kids. I had to do it though. I had to survive. You did him fired. Yeah, I did. I sued the company and that's how we got our financing. Ascenda was born with no optic nerve. You engineered her. Her name literally means to ascend. You know, she's gonna help a lot of people. She's here for a purpose. Make the world a better place? Yeah, those text messages, they don't mean perfect is malfunctioning. They mean she's working. Ready? Yeah. Everything looks normal. Okay. It's working. Last secret before I ask you to leave. Okay. You know, it's true. I stole all this technology, but nothing, no algorithm, no data is anything without this. Extremely low frequency electromagnetic radiation. It's everywhere. In the earth, high voltage power lines, I just modulate it to our brainwaves. Unstoppable. Spreading. Here, raw, unencrypted brainwaves transmitted over the power grid. You know, I'm really good at finding smart people like you, Ben. Now get the fuck out of here. You got a lot of work to do.
leave a message after the tone. Dr. Haley, we got some serious issues. Perfect, I mean. It was wonderful, darling. Let's do it again. Thank <laughs> you.